I'm Kira and welcome to You Kid Up. In this video we're gonna learn the song Dream in Blue by the Stray Birds. I dream in blue I drown in blue I left home on account of you Always loving someone new I dream in blue I chose this song because it's a great song to practice your transitions between chords. For this song you need to know the A minor chord, the G chord, the C chord and the F chord. If you don't know how to play these chords, please check out my other videos, they're in the description below. We'll be playing the song in a lower key than the original. If you would like to play along with the original key, you can place a capo on the second fret and still play along with the chords we'll learn in this video. Before we start practicing, please check if your uke is in tune. It should sound like this. If it doesn't sound like this and you don't know how to tune your uke, please check out my other video on how to tune your uke, it's in the description below. If we have a look at the intro, we can play along with the entire song. After we've played the intro, we only have to play verses and we play the same chords and strumming pattern as we've learned in the intro. Let's have a look. We start with the A minor chord and we play it for two counts. Then we have two counts of G. Then in the next bar we play the C chord. Then we have our third bar with two counts of F, two counts of G, and then the fourth bar with the A minor chord. Then we have another bar in which we play the F chord on the first count, and immediately the C chord on the second count. So we'll be playing C for three counts in that bar. Then we have the most challenging part, that's when we have one bar with four chords. We start on the first count with the F, second count C, third count G, and fourth count A minor. Then we have two counts of F, two counts of G, and one bar of C. Let's have a closer look at the bar where we have the four chords within one bar. We start with F, then we have C, G, A minor. If I would do it in a tempo that we do the play along, it would go like this. Here we go and F, C, G, A minor. I can imagine this is quite fast, so let's try it slowly together. We'll start by playing every chord for four counts and then we'll reduce it every time we practice. Here we go go and F two three switch C two three switch G two three switch A minor two three once more F two three switch C two three switch G two three switch A minor two three last time F two three switch C two three switch G two three switch A minor two three and stop. Now we're gonna do the same thing but we'll play every chord for three counts. Here we go and F two switch C two switch G two switch A minor two switch and F two switch C two switch G two switch A minor last time and F two switch C two switch G two switch A minor to stop. Great job! Let's try to do it with two counts. Here we go and F switch C switch G switch A minor once more F switch C switch G switch A minor again F switch C switch G switch A minor again F switch C switch G switch A minor once more F switch C switch G switch A minor and stop. Great job! If you find it too difficult at this moment, 
just come back again and try to practice it some more. If you do want to play along with the entire song but don't want to play this, you can always choose to play the F chord within the bar and that's it. Are you ready to try one chord on one count? Here we go and F, C, G, A minor, 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 last time, F, C, G, A minor. Wow, I'm really curious to know how far you got. Now we know how to play the most difficult transitions, let's try to play the entire intro. We start with the A minor chord. Here we go and A minor switch G switch C two three four and F switch G switch A minor two three four and F C three four F C G A minor F two G four C two three four. For this song you can choose to play a strumming pattern or you can choose to just lay down the chords as we've already practiced. For the strumming pattern I would like to do this it's down down up down down up down down up down down up. Sometimes we play this strumming pattern over two chords. So we have down, down, up on one chord and down, down, up on the other. And sometimes we only play it on one chord. Down, down, up, down, down, up. Let's practice the strumming pattern together. We'll try it slowly. Here we go. And down, down, up, down. Down, up, down, 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 down, up. Great job! The only time we don't play this strumming pattern is when we have the quick transition between F, C, G, A minor and when we have F and then C for three seconds. So in the bar with the F on the first count and C on the second count, we do this. It's down, 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 up. So instead of playing down, up on the second count, we just lay it down. If we try it with the chords, it goes like this. It's F, C, C, down, up. at the first verse we play the chords on these words. We start with I A minor, dream G, in blue C chord. Then we have F, I, drown G, in do A minor, a high F left home C on account of you, always F, loving C, someone G, New A minor, I, F, dream, G in blue, C. Shall we try to play the verse with the strumming pattern? We'll try it slowly. Here we go and I... all the parts I think you're ready for the play along. In this play along we're gonna do one intro and five verses. We're skipping the instrumental parts. After we've played the fifth verse we'll repeat a little bit from that verse and that's the part where we have I left home on account of you always loving someone new I dream in blue and then we repeat the sentence I dream in blue three times and in that last one we only sing I. 
but we do play the same chords. Are you ready for the play along? Here we go. episode. I hope you've enjoyed it and if you have please give it a thumbs up and if you would like to see more of my videos please subscribe to my channel. If you have any suggestions on which song we should play next please let me know in the comments below. Thank you for watching and I hope to see you next time. Bye!